Hey guys, what's up? It's Soup, and today I'm going to make a very big semi automatic wheat farm. I never thought this would be very valuable in 1.19, but yeah, it is. <laughs> I just wanted to sell some wheat to the farmers to get some emeralds. So, here you can see I uh, removed all the water sources uh, in the old farm and yeah uh, then I started um, you know, say, <laughs> uh, clearing the area making it uniform and yeah that's it enjoy it. Here you can see I use some kind of terra but I don't exactly remember the color maybe magenta maybe purple um, as my uh, base for the redstone lines because uh, whenever I am digging if I am digging underground or something I know this is for uh, this is not something to destroy. Then it's time for the trapdoors. These trapdoors keep water inside as long as they are uh, open and when they are closed, the water spills. Yeah, that's weird, but that's how it works. Always do the unit testing, otherwise you will regret. <laughs> So guys, the idea here is when we <laughs> yeah, technically close the trap door, the water flows and wash off all our crops, the right crops, to the bottom and we can have a hopper line like, or we can use alleys now. So it has to be four blocks. If it's more than four blocks, one thing is the water sources will be unavailable the other thing is uh, the water flow stops that's where the farm stops working Here I started building the third unit.
Okay, the farmlands are ready. It's time to plant the seeds. So guys, it's been a different video. I've never, uh, I haven't really done a full time lapse video like this. So hope you enjoyed it and learned something new. So yeah, uh, I'm gonna end this video after a little bit. We are planting the seeds. <laughs>